And a project that's been years in the making is finally underway. WHO 13's Natalie Painter joins us live from Merle Hay Mall. This is an exciting day for a lot of people, Natalie. Yeah, Erin and Janae, after about three years of planning, everyone involved is excited to start construction on the old Yonkers building over here at Merle Hay Mall and turn it into the new Buccaneers Arena. Nobody has done what we are undertaking to do at a mall like Merle Hay any place. Um, and so what we are doing in the Yonkers store and what the groundbreaking this afternoon will start is the construction of a 3,500 seat multi-use arena. Now the arena will not only house the Des Moines Buccaneers, but also allow space for youth hockey, other sporting events and concerts. Old and new businesses in the area say they will benefit from the crowds this will draw in. And the president of the Buccaneers tells us this is a unique opportunity. And they think that the people not only from the state, but from all over will want to experience these new additions. And that's what, you know, people I, I think hopefully don't lose sight of is this exciting day for the Des Moines Buccaneers, which who we're representing. But it's a great day for Des Moines. It's a great day for the city of Urbandale. Uh, it's a great day for Polk County. It's a great day for youth hockey in general and all of our ho hockey uh, neighbors. Now they plan to be finished and hope to have the first Buccaneers game by fall of 2023. All right. Thanks for the update, Natalie.